is great. As I was saying, for the O2 family to have so many champions in the pedigree and seeing Castle Countess and now Castle Urchin, his beautiful grey mare, at 25 years old this year, Castle Urchin was supreme champion of Clifton on two occasions, twice reserved, twice reserved supreme champion and class winner seven times. She retired from the showing ring unbeaten. A fantastic, fantastic career this mare has had. Urchin has now finished breeding. She has produced 18 foals to continue to enhance her legacy. They, the owners retain many of her daughters and granddaughters at the castle. <laughs> question, and we welcome forth our winner from 2009. This is Curramore Cashel, the supreme champion from 2009, bred by Eamon Burke and owned by Joe Burke. So we can welcome into the centre of the arena, Curramore Cashel. Like I was saying, from our castle, 2009 Clifton Supreme Champion in his 23rd year. Kerr Moore Castle is one of the outstanding show sellings of his time. He has had an immense success in Ireland and abroad. Even as a particularly late foe, there were always high hopes of Kerr Moore. Kerr Moore passing his inspection at just two years old and, become, and being shown with huge success from a young age. He truly is truly a once-in-a-lifetime pony and has been the best of servants to the Burks. Furmore had a long but successful road to his Clifton Supreme Championship title. Having been a multiple winning multiple winning horse since a three-year-old, he won the junior and senior stallion class on multiple occasions. He has won the progeny class and was Clifton Visitors Champion three times before his impressive 2009 year. In that year, he won his class, the progeny class, his son was junior champion, along with several of his progeny winning on the day. He again secured the visitor's championship and finally secured his title of Supreme Clifton champion in 2009. Kurt Moore went on to concentrate on, on stud duties until 2012, when together with, with Joe, they made the long journey to France to spend the summer at Elon. Elevage du Soulier, where, where there for stud, whilst there for stud duties, Kermont also managed to pick up the French national championship and also competed in the in-hand section of the European Pony Championships in Fostenville, where he was crowned European Supreme Champion Pony. His progeny can be seen competing all over the world in all disciplines, and he has started a significant amount of Clifton winners over the past 20 years. Kirk Moore loves nothing more than hacking out on the roads during the winter and stood duties in the summer. He is truly part of the family and is cherished by all. He has had a 100% success rate in getting mares in full this year and will continue to stand at stud with Eamon, but limited to mares who are tested NN for HWSD. So once again, ladies and gentlemen, Kirk Moore Cashel has shown phenomenal presence and success in his Beating career and a stud career. So please put your hands together for your 2009 Clifton Supreme Champion, Kirk Moore Cashel. So next we welcome into the centre of the main arena. It is your Supreme Champion from 2010, read by Patrick, Patrick Christie King, and owned by Michael O'Toole. Again, the O'Toole producing so many great horses. Village Lineage. So as we can see now, your 2010 Supreme Champion Mayor, Village Lineage, um, a full at foot, a fantastic looking coat full at that. The 20 year old Mayor, she was champion as a seven year old in 2010. She was one of the last remaining ponies carrying the legendary village prefix. Lynette's, Lynette's progeny have excelled in, in show rings both here, here in Ireland and overseas. She continues to be a cornerstone of Cashel Stud, where she is joined by, by three of her daughters. So ladies and gentlemen, your 2010 Supreme Champion Mayor, Village Lydia. So as we can see, at 20 years of age, she's still in fine fettle, producing lovely foals with a lovely step. As you can see yourself, as a broodmare passing down that lovely confirmation 
as you can see her flick her toes out in front. So ladies and gentlemen, Billet Lineage. So we move on to your 2011 champion. And this horse is bred by Elizabeth Petch and owned by the Kyle Moore Trust, Kyle Moore Abbey. And show Pushing Juliet. She won the Supreme Championship here at Clifton Show in 2011 as a two-year-old filly. She is sired by Janice out of Cushing C. Mist, who is the Glen, who is by Glen Carey Prince. So great, great pedigree going back to generations there for Cushing Julie. Cushing Julie was bred in County Court by a steam breeder, Mrs. Elizabeth Petch. She is paraded here today with her colorful, peaceful fion by Grange fin Finian Sparrow. Following her win at Clifton, she was produced under saddle and lightly campaigned at shows before retiring as a broodmare. To date, she has bred five foals. Cushine Julie is currently owned by Conor Moore Abbey, located in Connemara, County Galway. Conor Moore Abbey is one of Ireland's most memorable, most memorable visitor attractions and shares a Conor, Connemara pony with the global audience. The alien information talks on the Connemara pony are given to the half a million visitors that visit Kylemore Abbey annually. More information can be found at kylemoreabbey.com. So, ladies and gentlemen, your 2011 Supreme Champion, Cushing Julie. So, moving on now to our 2013 champion. We welcome Gertine Call to the centre of the arena. Gertine Call, a fantastic horse in his day. He was champion, as I said, in 2013. He won the champion of champions the same year and was the first pony to achieve that fantastic award. It's been, it's been a very hard thing for any pony to do, for any pony to do, to win the champion and the champion of champions is a fantastic result. So far, the only stallion to win the Clifton Supreme Champion and sire a stallion Clifton Supreme Champion, Slackport Prince, Slack Prince. He went to Germany in 2015. He went on to win the Supreme Champion at the Castle Wickerat International Show in Germany and stood reserve loose jumping champion at the same show at the same time. And returning to Ireland in 2008, he's repeating successfully ever since. Bred by Cahill Mullen in Roundstone, he won in Clifton, as we said in 2013, with Kevin Bulger and Laura McBeam. And since then, he was bought in 2015 and owned by Lula and Kevin Connolly since 2015. So, ladies and gentlemen, as we see parading in front of us, the fantastic selling Gertine Cahill. to see Gertie and Carl here the Supreme Champion from 2013 being presented as well by our Breed Association President Dave Sheehy. So now we move on to our next champion from 2014, the Supreme Champion bred and owned by Kieran Curran. This is Glen Carrick Knight. Glen Carrick Knight won the first of his three wins in Clifton in 2012 followed by 2013 and 2014 and he also took Supreme Champion. Not only has Knight, the stable name, established himself as one of one of the it ponies in the ring himself, but he's put himself on the map of not only the sire of this era, but one of all one of the all-time greats greats. We have countless championships, champions after champions in Ireland, in the UK and all over the world. He is sired the junior champion in Clifton no less six times as well as a champion of champion foal and his daughter who then carried Princess Katie taking the Supreme Champion in 2019. Knight is an RDS champion himself in 2012 and now adds siring a champion there too with his son Glen Carrick Duban taking top honours in the RDS just last week in the Royal Dublin Horse, Horse Society which is a fantastic achievement for all the connections of Glen Carey Knight, your Supreme Champion from 2014. 
as you can see, he looks absolutely fantastic. As he's been a, a sire of sires at the moment as well. So it's great to see him looking so well and still looking so strong and fit as he continues to you know, live on in, in great stead and really produce top, top class horses. So now we move on to our Supreme Champion from 2015. We welcome to the center of ring number one here, Drumbad Fletcher Moss, bred by Jim Ferguson and owned by Joe Burke. The 2015 Clifton Supreme Champion, now at a fine age of 19 years old, this saying had a short but, su but successful showing career with Eamon and Joe Burke. Purchased from his breeder, Jim Ferguson, in County Fermanagh at Christmas time, 2013, it was a quick turnaround to have Fletcher, Fletcher ready for the 2014 showing and breeding season. Fletcher was shown on 13 occasions in that season, with 13 wins and 12 supreme titles. The one that eluded him that year was, Clift, was Clifton. Although a class winner that year, he missed out on the championship title. In 2015, Fletcher had an easier showing year and made a triumphant return to Clifton, once again taking the stallion class win. But this time, he marks his place in the history books by taking home the coveted Supreme Championship title. Since then, Fletcher Moss has been a popular choice for breeders and has produced winners in all disciplines, with his progeny winning here in Clifton, both under saddle and in hand. Many of his offspring can be seen competing successfully here in Ireland, here in Ireland and around the world. He is by the legendary Hazy Match and out of an Usheen mare. Drumbad Fletcher Moss will continue to stand at stud with Eamon Burke and will enjoy a well-earned break after a busy stud season again this year. So ladies and gentlemen, your 2015 Supreme Champion, Drumbad Fletcher Moss. So yes, it's so great to see the beautiful stallion still looking absolutely beautiful as he stands here in front of us. As we all know, like a lot of these Panamara horses, they start off a real steel grey, go dapple, and then go a beautiful white. So we move on now to Lacra Beauty, your supreme champion from 2016, bred by Tim Connor and owned by Fiona and Tomas Grimes. We welcome into the centre arena your 26, 2016 supreme champion, Lacra Beauty. So Lacra Beauty, now at a fine age of 23, the remarkable Connemara mare is retired from active breeding and she has left behind a distinguished legacy. Throughout her impressive breeding career, she produced 10 exceptional foals that have made their mark in equestrian circles across Sweden, the United Kingdom, France and Ireland. So next we welcome into the centre of the main arena here, we welcome Posey Medley, your Supreme Champion from 2017, bred by Hubert Laurent and owned by Noel Sweeney. Posey Melody, with an exceptional breeding of Imperator Melody, out of the mare by Equinox Melody, and her offspring and siblings have experienced huge success in the showing ring around Europe. Posey won the Supreme Champion Normandy show in 2012, she, was all, she also won the Reserve Supreme Champion Fontainebleau at the European Championship in 2012 and also Reserve Supreme Champion on the French National Show Pompadour in 2012. She was crowned Clifton Supreme Champion there in 2017. Her full brother, Odious Melody, was Supreme Champion in Finland in 2017. A number of her offspring, offspring have been very successful in France to date. So ladies and gentlemen, your 2017 Supreme Champion Mayor, Posey Melody. So it's great to see Posey Melody and one of, one of her offspring. She really throws that same sort of stamp ring upright, good shoulder on the pole as well. So we wish them well in their future as well. So we move on now 
to your 2018 Supreme Champion. This is Slackport Prince, read by Martin King and owned by Brendan and Declan O'Flynn. Slackport Prince was Supreme Champion here at Clefton in 2018. Cyrus Kertine Cow, the damn Slackport Pony. Slackport, Slackport Prince's progeny are doing exceptionally well in the performance and the showing. Prince had a great temperament and passed on to one of his See select one print. The parade in front of the grandstand is looking extremely well. What a, what a fight. I'm sure it'd love to be still showing here at Clifton. But once again, ladies and gentlemen, it's just great to see all these previous champions looking so well and still in, still in fine fettle as they parade in front of us here and receive their very well earned uh, champions ropes from our very kind sponsor, from our chairman, Dave Sheehy. Slackboard Prince is going to give us a little walk away and jog back to show that he still has a, to show that he still deserves a Supreme Championship title here in Clifton. And the 98th winning of this fantastic show, celebrating 100 years of the Connemara Holy Breeders Society. And we bless the sunshine by getting laid down on these champions. And you can see Slackboard Prince still full of life, He's breaking into canter. So, Again, we thank the owner of Slackport Prince, Mr. Brendan and Declan and Flynn, for bringing them here today. We appreciate it very much. Just to show you guys how much we appreciate and respect these fantastic champions. We're going to welcome into the center of the arena, Carrick Princess Katie, your supreme champion from 2019. Read by Geroid Curran and owned by Katie Curran. This fantastic mare has a great lineage and we, we met Glen Carrick Knight earlier, her father, earlier in the, in the parade. So we now welcome this Clifton Junior Champion from 2019 and a Supreme Champion in 2019. Excuse me there. So yes, Glen Carrick Princess Katie with a fold up foot. Still looking absolutely fantastic and they were Junior Champion in 2018, excuse me and went on then to win the Supreme Championship in 2019. Adam Glencarry Princess, who is two-time Clifton winner and reserve champion in 2006, and out of Glencarry Knight, the star we saw earlier, who did so well in many in his illustrious career. And then grandsire Glencarry Princess was Supreme Champion in 2003. So this horse, owned by Katie Kern, just listening out to that Glencarry prefix, it, it says everything from the sire to the dam to the dam sire. It's an amazing breeding performance by, by the family to produce so many Clifton champions. So ladies and gentlemen, please put your hand together for your 2019 winners, Glen Carrick, Princess Katie, and the current family. Like I was saying earlier, it's great to see the mares with their foals at foot here in the front in the main arena. He presented their well-deserved prize. And we, again, we thank all the owners and breeders for bringing them and, and handlers today for bringing them here today to showcase to us as we move on to our last but not least, our latest champion from 2022. We welcome Cashel Bay Katie, your supreme champion from 2022, bred and owned by Robbie and Barbara Fallon. It's so great to have our champion from last year back with us today. Castle Bay's, Castle Bay Katie's achievements in hand under saddle are as follows. Winner of the 10 to 15 year old mare class with foot at foot, champion broodmare, and going on to become overall supreme champion at the Clifton Show in 2022. Fantastic performance that was. Winner of the four to six year old mare in hand class in Clifton 2018. Winner of the reserve supreme ridden class in Clifton here in 2017, winner of the four to five year old winning class at the, at the Royal Club and Horse Society show in 2016, and winner of the in-hand three year old filly class and reserve junior champion in Clifton in 2015, and many more accolades. Like that's just a fantastic CV for a broodmare to have, and it's so great to see her look here today looking so well with a full, with a full at foot. So, Ladies and gentlemen, your champion mayor from 2022, Castle Bay Kate.
I just want to make point out that all of you, all of, all of you are a bit eagle-eyed. You'll see in a matter of seconds, we will, will be presenting a green robe to Castle Bay Kate as our, as our most recent winner. I'm going to give them a lovely emerald green robe kindly provided this weekend to all our champions. So, let me step you forward there. Not to take away from the new roads, but the, the previous winners from last year will be receiving their green robe this year. You can see how much it means to all connections to be invited back here to Parade. And we thank every single one of you from the very start for, for joining us here today and giving us a great, great look at all these fantastic mares. We're back as far as Castle Countess here to Townsend and one winner to Castle Urchin, champion from 2002 and 2007. Kirk Moore Cashel, the Supreme Champion from 2009. We thank the Burke family. Village Lineage, the Champion from 2010. We thank the breeders, Patrick Christie King, and owned by Michael O'Toole, and the O'Toole for presenting here today. Pusheen Judy, your Champion from 2011. Bred by Elizabeth Petch, owned by the Kyle Moore Trust. Like we were saying, Kyle Moore Abbey, not far from here. So a great tourist attraction if you're looking to get outside of Clifton this weekend. The 2013 champion, Curtin Cahill. That fantastic prefix, we'll be hearing it for many years to come. Bred by Cahill Mullen and owned by Ulla Dorothy Connolly. Len Carrick Knight then, the Supreme Champion, 2014. Bred and owned by Kieran Kern. Drumbat Fletcher Moss, the champion from 2015. Bred by Tim Ferguson and owned by Joe Burke. Aqua Beauty, the Supreme Champion, 2016. Bred by Tim Hunter. Owned by Fiona and Tomas Burns. Posey Melody then, your 2017 champion, run by Hubert Lauren, and owned by Noel Sweeney. Slackport Prince, the Supreme Champion 2018. Red by Mr. Martin King, and owned by Brent, Brendan and Declan O'Flynn. Mary then carried Princess, your champion in 2019. Red by Curran, and owned by Katie Curran. And finally, your champion from 2022. Cashel Bay Kate, bred and owned by Robbie Barber Fowler. Previous champions, leave ring number one, our main array. Please put your hands together for all our champions over the past years. What a fantastic achievement it's been to win so many illustrious times here at Clifton and to come back again to show us just that these horses are still a fine fettle, looking fantastic and are still having illustrious careers. So we thank you all again for your time, for our Thanks, parade you. of champions, and again to all our owners and breeders. We really appreciate you, you guys coming here this weekend with these past chapters.